Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we have news and today's news is coming from Anima XYZ or AXYZ, you know, depending on what you're calling it. And today we are looking at something that is incredible. We already talked about this thing before about Anima 4 or the Anima 40 that will be coming very soon. And this is a tool that will actually allow you to use for the digital human. And there was a lot of talk about this thing in the comment section and i told you guys that the way that the tool is going there will be a very clear distinction between what you regularly use and what you're going to find out with this because the guys from anima xyz they've actually taken their time to do a huge library of motion capture data and you know captured real actors and they've found a way to compress uh files that should be way more than five gig of data that supports both the formation for clothes the formation of the characters you know uh facial animation and all that and they found a way to compress all of that and pack them into about 150 to 250 megabytes of fire and these things are going to be accessible to you guys so the cool thing about this is before now they do have a tool which everybody actually knew as the anima xyz which you can simply use for basically any kind of crowd simulation thing that you want so you could have actually seen this in various productions and for some small scale or large scale cloud simulation this particular tool that they created previously had plug-in integration for both maya 3d studio max and mo4d and also unreal and at the point it was actually called the metropoly range and it came with stock rigged characters but at that point users can only import these characters with the motion clips that was embedded with the anima xyz which was pretty good because at that point you can actually use it to control the particles that had to drive the simulation there was also things that had to do with collision that you can actually do the animated scenes can also be exported as either fbx collada and even v-ray formats of course this was really really nice for a lot of people to use but with the anima 4d right here there's a huge list of things that you can do with this because as it stands the anima 4d seems to be blurring the distinction between realistic characters and also characters that you're definitely going to see see as cg characters i mean once you take a look at this you can see the deformation on the clot you can see the facial expression at the same time you'll be able to see all of those up close nuances that you can only see when you are looking at a real life character probably you might have also thought about creating models that can have as way realistic stuff like this but it's pretty cool to see that the guys from anima xyz have taken that button off your shoulders and they're giving you a tool that will be able to put your mind at ease and this tool right now will be available for shipping by Thursday the 19th of March 2020 and of course they haven't announced the price yet but if you want to get the anima 3.5 which is a very incredible tool if i must say you can also get this for windows which is the only platform that it supports right now you can get this for windows for about 280 dollars you can also choose to use the free version which is known as the light version and you can simply use this for also commercial work you can only export four seconds of animation and still renders by default are unrestricted so if you just want to use this to place things in your architectural design, you want to use this to, you know, use them as placeholders in your pre-visualization, you can simply download the free version and use these things for commercial use without any form of restriction. And before we go, it's also worth knowing that the tool which we're taking a look at, which is the Anima XYZ, just recently had a partnership with Epic Games and they have also bundled a couple of characters into twin motion 2020 and in case you haven't seen the video about that link is going to be in the description and it's just very nice to see that once you get a tool like this that comes pre-built with idle movement that includes breathing limb movement facial deformations and all that stuff you can actually get going with it and for those wondering what the downside of this tool will be there is practically not so much of a downside since you're not going to be able to animate these as they are already pre-animated the best part for this is the guys from anima xyz are actually saying that why they're creating a tool like this is so you'll be able to 
you know get them up close if you want to use some very interesting characters for the foreground more like your hero characters and then you can populate the background with low resolution meshes or low resolution animated characters and this is pretty cool as it kind of breathes more life into your scene it's just going to make whatever you're creating look way more realistic compared to other counterpart 3d animated characters that do not have all of these new cool features that is coming with the anima 4d and according to the guys from anima xyz multi-core cpu would also be possible and you can use as much actors at the same time and you'll be able to achieve about 120 fpx when you're working using unreal engine so i would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section what do you think about you know the whole thing that the guys at anima xyz are talking about and for anyone that wants to download this too link to this is going to be in the description if you want to read about this link to it is also going to be in the description so that you can take a look and see what you can do with that and if you like this video you know what to do you can go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend and if you're new here it's going to be amazing for you to hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until i see you guys again with the tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace